When we're talking about acids and bases, there's a couple of different terms that we need to be clear about. When we're talking about strong versus weak, we're talking about the properties of the acid and the base and how readily they release their hydrogen or hydroxide ions into solution. If they release it readily, they're called strong acids and strong bases. If they release their ions less readily, they are weak. And when we're talking about concentrated versus dilute, what we're talking about is the amount of water uh, or other solvent that is in the solution. So I want you to consider it like when you're making cordial. So let's draw a picture of a cup and you pour your lemon cordial into the bottom. Okay, so that's the concentrated cordial that you bought at the shops. So in this cordial there is a high concentration of cordial molecules. Okay, so that means there's a lots of cordial molecules and not much water. Another way that we can draw this is, and I want you to get used to this, defin uh, this way of drawing it, that just means high, and that square bracket there means concentration. So you'll, you'll use that more and more in chemistry and also in biology. So that's a high concentration. And now what happens when you pour water into your, uh, your cup and you dilute your cordial. So what we're going to do now is we add water to the top and we dilute our cordial. So if these dots are our cordial molecules, what we've got in between is our water molecules. So when we dilute it, we have a low concentration of the, um, the cordial molecules compared with the water molecules. So if we're talking about acids and bases, concentrated means a solution that's got lots of acid or lots of base and not much water. And dilute is when we've got less acid and more water.